Hey guys, so I look homeless. My hoodie is also on backwards. That's how today's went. Hi, Frey. So, this day has been a weird day. I worked today, and this lady came into the store, and she told me that, she, like, she told me and my boss that she was a palm reader, and my boss has, like, seen this lady before. Apparently, people that used to work at my store went to go see her, and so then I was like, <laughs> Maybe I should go. So I'm standing there and she's like, give me your hands. So I give her my hands and I'm like, I'm like, lady, I have to work, but I give her my hands. And she goes on to tell me a whole bunch of things and then she goes on to tell me I'm gonna be my soulmate. And I'm just like, like, if fuckboy is synonymous with soulmate, you might, you might have a thing going for you. Except not all of them fuck boys. You know who you are. Whatever. She gave me her card and I was like, I really shouldn't go. But like, <laughs> curious. So I think I'm gonna rope my friend in my friend Shannon in to coming with me because I just got off the phone with this lady and I booked an appointment for tomorrow morning. And I'm gonna make Shannon come with me. So um, unless she doesn't come. And then, like, maybe this is just, like, a plot for me to get murdered. But, like, I hope not. Because she said I was going to be my soulmate. <laughs> like, how can I say no? I'm very skeptical about these things. So, we're going to see how it goes. Okay. Good morning. Today is the day. Um. Shannon agreed to come with me. Which should be a lovely time because I love Shannon. Come on, car. I'm doing this right now. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go get money and then um, something for breakfast because I didn't make breakfast. I was gonna have oatmeal, but then I was really late and bed too long. So we gotta go get a bagel or something. And like maybe a tea. I don't know if I can I texted Shannon to see if she wanted anything, and she hasn't texted me back yet. So, we're gonna go to the bank first. Then I texted Robin, and I said, Shannon and I spontaneously decided to go to a palm reader this morning, so I'm gonna share my location with you in case I die. Which I know is gonna be fine, like, I know it's fine. I'm just like being dramatic and like a little anxious, so this is what my friends get. I'm like really skeptical because this lady believes that. what this lady is gonna say like is she gonna say anything legit because like I've been to something like this before and I actually believe in this stuff too. like in certain categories of this stuff I think is legit but I just like I don't know she was like promoted herself hard though like apparently she does it everywhere she goes there's like I get it get your coin you know Um, Alright, she texted me back. So, we're gonna get in this massive freaking line, which I could have done while I was waiting for her. But am I smart? No. But, like, at least Shannon gets to come. So, the possibility of me getting murdered is, like, down a little bit, you know? I got the money. <laughs> We're rich. Just kidding. Also, I still have 
like a ton of freaking time to kill. Everyone else's day going. I kind of want a donut, but like people should have eat donuts for breakfast. Guys, I'm tired. Should I just get coffee? I'm gonna get like a small iced coffee. I feel like that's always a decent choice. Excuse me, miss, but I was here first. Don't you? No, no, no. She's totally gonna do it because she refuses to look at me. Dum dum. medium ice cap with an espresso shot okay. and then can I get a small vanilla iced coffee and a cinnamon raisin bagel toasted with butter Coffee all over me. What a blessing. Why am I doing this? Who am I? <clears throat> okay. Hello. So it's been a couple hours since you saw me. I like didn't vlog or anything in the reading because I didn't want it to be weird. And I also didn't vlog while Shannon was with me because I didn't know if she wanted to be on camera. Um but the reading, okay, so a load of freaking horse crap, okay? And I don't say that lightly because I've been to a lot of these things. I think that some of them are legit, some of them are not, you know? Like, it's really just like picky and choosy. But like, she didn't tell me anything that I didn't already know about myself. Um, she told me that someone might die and I was like, dude, like, Everybody says that, like, and so I don't really believe a word she says, to be quite honest. However, I'm not going to say her name just because I don't want to ruin her little side hustle. Um, was it worth the hundred and twenty dollars that she usually charges? Most definitely not. Um, if you're bored and want something fun to do, was it hilarious? Yes. Like to the people who like actually pay a hundred and twenty dollars to like have a reading with this lady. I feel bad for you. Like, it was fun, and it was funny, but, like, it's just, like, the professionalism isn't there. She literally just took, like, an hour and a half to, like, talk about her life and, like, her grandchildren and, like, how she lived her life and, like, all that stuff. So, like, was it ideal? No. Have it been to lots of other more professional situations? Yes. Will I go see her again? No. Yeah, I don't really have much to say other than it's hard with this stuff. Because it's all pretty much subjective. She had some angel oracle cards and she literally just read what the oracle card said. And does that make sense? And does this apply to you? And how does that make you feel? And I don't know. It was more so just like a chat session for her over anything else. Was I hoping for some big revelation? No. As I told you guys before I even went, highly skeptical. Shannon and I also went, there's like this like wellness and harmony center in the mall that we work at and they do stuff like that so we were gonna go check it out but they were closed so that didn't really work out for us. But um, yeah, no, 
wouldn't recommend it to anyone, but I'm not going to say the name, so you're just going to have to figure it out. And honestly, you could probably just like tell yourself what you want your life to be rather than going and getting someone else to tell you. Um, but other than that, that's the tea. So I'm probably just going to go eat Dawn's or something and 